Hello everyone, and a welcome on back to some more Minecraft. Uh, before we get started with the builds I have in mind, we are going to go and name our horse finally. And the name that we have chosen is Mercedes. And this name is coming from a comment that I did get from a Bigly Shrunk. I hope I said your name right. I will put the comment on screen. And um, yeah, as you see, there is no nether portal over there anymore because we are moving it and hopefully you can see it right there above my head. That is where the nether portal is going to be and that's going to be the build idea I have today is kind of decorating around it a little bit and I also wanted to build a bridge as well going over like leading toward it and i also made a spyglass <laughs> i forgot that you can make these but anyways let's get started all right we're gonna come right on in here and yes as you see i did add more uh bookshelves which i did add some uh what do we got here i have fortune three and i'm breaking three on a diamond pickaxe i was trying so hard to get silk touch but i have not gotten silk touch yet at all and here is the anvil i did put it up here so we're going to name the horse. I hope I'm actually spelling this right. Mercedes. So let's go give our horse finally a name. I do have more saddles and leashes. So, um, or leads, I should say. Uh, in case we get more horses. So if we end up getting more horses, definitely leave um, names. And you are now Mercedes. I actually really do like that name. So thank you so much for that name. Now let's go gather all of the tools and stuff that we need for the builds. And then we will get started. Oh, um, yeah, disregard this right here. Um, <laughs> I was taking quite some time to try to get rid of this big little hill right here because eventually i want to have a barn and just like separate little areas for the animals and try to also move them a little bit away from the house since they're kind of annoying but that'll be a separate build it's going to take a little bit to um to clear that all out but this is everything i hope everything that is needed for the builds i have in mind so Let's go ahead and grab all these and head right on over. Alright, so here we are. The portal is right over there. And I did do some uh, some stairs as well mixed with, I think it was stone, stone, brick, and I think andesite. But right here is where I wanted like a bridge. Nothing too crazy. And I also was going to do floating lanterns also. Which, um, what colors do I have again? I have yellow, purple, pink, and red. So I did do that because I want floating lanterns so bad because, you know, tangled, you know, whatever. But, um, yeah, I hope we have everything we need. If not, I will get more. So I think, I think I'm probably gonna do the portal first. I think, yeah, I think the portal first is what we will do. And then we'll work on the bridge. But let's just go ahead and go on over here. Alright. I kind of... I was thinking of doing like a different entrance for this. But I kind of like how it looks a little bit. And yeah, as you see, I have the stairs here as well as over there. I did some like little texturing to the ground. I really hate these vines. I really do. I'm gonna have to like get rid of... Like actually get rid of it. But yeah, here is the portal... What is that? What is over here? Oh! Okay! Oh! What, are they like... I forget what they're called. What are these things called? Is it a cheetah? They're so cute. Alright, anyways. So. For this, I was thinking of doing a... Um, like a lush cave and then like a little amethyst type of... Uh, type of build for this, I think. So I was probably going to do some of the calcite and the smooth basalt to kind of um, to like be around it with a little bit of amethyst. I wanted to put the shards on there, but I feel like maybe silk touch is an easier way to get the blocks with that already on it. I have no idea, but, and we also have some um, 
azalea leaves and uh the flowering azalea leaves and then the regular azalea leaves and some moss blocks so we're definitely going to work with all of that and then for the bridge is probably going to be the campfires the spruce slabs the the trap doors i think i made a little bit more lanterns than i needed but you can never have too many lanterns so oh and some chains too as well but we're gonna do this first and we're gonna see how it looks i am kind of excited for this i definitely wanted to um put it in a better spot and when you go in there we're pretty much near where the other portal was it just got moved just slightly but it's okay i kind of hoping it'd be in a different area but we're gonna go ahead and get started with this and I will show you guys once it's a little bit completed. I hope you guys enjoy this and yeah, I'll see you guys soon. All right, you guys, the portal is done. And as you see, my level is now a seven. Um, I did record and show it off. I went inside and I think like a creeper or something blew me up, blew the portal inside of the nether up. So I respawned back in the beginning and I had to come back, go inside, grab myself. Luckily, there was another portal that was like right in the area. So I did grab my stuff. Um, <laughs> oh God, I was level 26 too. Uh, whatever, it's fine. We, we do have all our stuff, which is a good thing. So let me go ahead and re-show you guys since that footage I don't have. I did get rid of. <laughs> But I'm going to show you the portal again, which is right here. Um, the texture on the ground has some of the amethyst. It has some, I think this is like mossy block or something. And um, yeah, it looks pretty good. I also have some of the basalt, which I think is what that is called. Or no, this right here. Sorry. But yeah, this is what it looks like. It's not the best. I also do have some floating lanterns as well. But yeah. It's not the best looking. It kind of does look a little cute though, I'm not gonna lie. Um, I was gonna, you know, show you guys where we are now in the nether. I'm kind of terrified to do this again. <laughs> like, the second I walked in there, all I heard was that sizzling creeper noise, if you know what I'm talking about. And yeah, next thing you know, yeah, an explosion happened, but it's okay. It's all right. We got all our stuff back. Because I was going to be like, oh my god, please, no. I don't want to lose all my stuff. But we got it all back. And let me show you where we are. Alright, there are some of those, um... Yeah, these things right here. Yeah. These things right here. <laughs> But yeah, this is the portal now. The portal before, I have no idea where it was. I think it's somewhere around here, isn't it? I think it's somewhere around here. And then the portal we did do before is not that far from here, actually. I don't remember which dir- Oh, don't look at him. I don't remember what direction it is, though. But it's not that far from here. But yeah, this, this is our now portal. The first portal we created. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna leave. <laughs> I'm gonna leave. Alright, let's go. Nope. I'm leaving. I'm not trying to die again. <laughs> Alright. I just wanted to show you guys where the portal is now. But I'm gonna go ahead after, you know, all of that happened. Not exactly happy about it but it's all right i do need to do the pathway here as well i might do that off camera but we also have the bridge right here that we're gonna do which like i said we're gonna use we'll most likely use spruce slabs trap doors and um do i not have campfires anymore <laughs> no i don't have campfires anymore <laughs> oh god i might have to double check if they're in there but i kind of don't want to because I do remember I was kind of on fire, so who knows. I might have to make more campfires because I kind of wanted that as the um, like the walkway. But I'm going to go ahead, get this started. I am so glad I got all my crap back, especially the damn pickaxe. We have Fortune 3 on it. I hope y'all didn't hear that. <laughs> Let's get started. 
All right, I am finally done with the bridge. I am loving the floating lantern so much. It literally just like reminds me of Tangled when I see this. But yeah, this is the bridge and it definitely took me a little bit to do because I needed to get more wood and everything to make more campfire since I lost the ones I had. But this is the bridge. Oh, I love it. It is so freaking cute with the floating lanterns. Oh my god. You guys tell me what you think. Any additions that you want to see? Let me know. Any other builds you want to see? Definitely let me know. I was thinking of maybe eventually doing an aquarium. I don't know though. <laughs> but yeah. Um, I love this bridge. It looks so good. Oh my god. I love it. And yeah, this dude has been here the whole freaking time. Wait, where did he go? This dude, come here. He has all this like coral reef stuff, which off camera, I did find a coral reef. It was like in the direction of where we first started and I just went straight, not that far, and there was a coral reef. I tried to get some stuff, but I was like, maybe we need, um, what is it? Yeah, I don't know either, you guys. Silk Touch. I was thinking that we probably need Silk Touch in order to grab the stuff in the coral reef to actually have it as is. Because I had it, but it was a dead something. I don't know. But yeah, I, I kind of like it so far. I might do a little bit of um, like some adjustments to this. And uh, yeah, I, I really like it. And I dread going back in there. I really, really do. Lost 20 levels going in there, but it's all right. But yeah, I also need to do some, like, like a pathway right here. So I'll probably do off camera since this took me a while, a while to deal with, you know, the nether stuff, a while to, you know, do this, but I really like it. I really, really do. You guys let me know what you think about this. I, I love it. I love it so much. All right, you guys, before I actually end this episode, um, cause I've, cause once I check back the, the footage, uh, it was only going to be maybe like 13 to 15 minutes long. So I decided I'm going to do another build that I was going to do in a different episode. Um, it's nothing too crazy, nothing too big, but this spot right here behind me, I was thinking of doing like a little campfire site type of deal or whatever. You'll, you'll see what I mean once it's completed, but before I go ahead and show you that, there is something else off in the distance over there that I don't think I showed you completely. So let's go get a closer look. All right, meet all four of my mushroom cows. Soon to be, I believe, six once I breed them again. But yeah, I did go out on an adventure, like I did say before. I also did go back to the mushroom island. I grabbed another one of these and yeah. We have four mushroom cows now and I am loving it. I love them. They need to get as far away from this place as possible because they are quite annoying. But yeah, a later episode, and I mean a later episode, this little spot all over here is going to be like a barn. I will probably, it'll probably be like a big barn maybe put like a chicken coop or something you know around there something like that and when i say big i mean this okay this is this is gonna take a lot of work like <laughs> i used so many shovels so many pickaxes just to clear out what i thought was a lot but yeah there's still quite a bit that needs to get cleared out over here was a big hole like if i went ahead and it broke one of these there's a hole down there you can't really tell but oh there he is right there you know you can stay in there <gasps> okay i didn't mean to put that there no i did not mean to put that there there we go he was trying to get me there wasn't he but yeah this is gonna take a lot of work which is gonna get done off camera don't know how long it'll take but like I said, that's where our barn and stuff is going to go. That really does look pretty up there. But in this episode, we did what we did. And before I end it, because I was going to end it after the bridge. But I was like, you know what? It's too short. We're going to do something else. It's going right here. And I think I have 
hopefully yet again i say this all the time but hopefully everything we need so we got some oak we got some spruce spruce stairs a crafting table we have a um composer composter there we go composter <laughs> oh my god my brain is broken we have some spruce signs we have some fences all that good stuff that's what we're gonna put right on in here it's gonna get dark soon so i'll probably have to sleep before i get started but yeah i didn't want to end it with just 13 to 15 minutes worth of footage so i was like let me do this build and um hopefully it comes out good so i will see you shortly all right you guys here it is our little campsite i was kind of uh, a little worried because it's uh kind of close to the fountain but she'll do it looks so cute i have a bed in there we have some uh some barrels a crafting table lanterns a composter some oak logs some spruce trap doors an oak sign a campfire which has spruce um spruce signs are wrapped around it the build is stone spruce fences um we also have some stone as well you know around the outside there some spruce stairs spruce uh just regular spruce blocks it looks pretty good i actually didn't finish doing this part right here though to be completely honest with you kind of make it look a little bit um a little bit better i had to make another uh another shovel since mine broke but it looks pretty good i like it you guys let me know what you think i decided that i wanted to do a, another build just because you know if i ended off where i was going to the video is going to be a little bit too short so here it is i love it it looks perfect and it definitely fits this spot right here pretty well um but yeah this is it and like i said we have that right over there which looks so good so good i might try to tweak the the nether portal a little bit to make it a little bit better and if i do i'll definitely show you in the next episode if i decide to do that but yeah you guys let me know of anything else you would like to see in the next episode i hope you guys enjoyed this and uh yeah this is our uh it's our little toasty campfire site so yeah again i hope you guys enjoyed this and i will catch you guys in the next video bye guys